Dodge trucks, known for their toughness and strength, can become everyone's favorite because they play a role in many people's lives. But have we ever considered Dodge's iconic models that can bring you fame due to their rarity? Well, this is exactly what we are doing today. We're about to travel back in time to glance through 10 rare Dodge trucks which have been classified as classics throughout the years. But hey, before we really get going, why not consider hitting the subscribe button so you get to virtually experience driving your favorite Dodge trucks. Number 10. The 1976 Warlock 1976 Warlock, all the way from the 70s, which was a part of the Dodge Adult Toys. The key attribute of the 1976 Warlock is its inclusion of customized vehicles. The classy and sophisticated touch-ups made this stand out during its era of reign. The subtle modifications of the truck included chrome and decal stripes and special wheels, plus real wood in the bed. The real wood bed as an interior gives an authentic and luxurious touch of culture and fine craftsmanship. Sounds elegant, doesn't it? Well, the finery of the superiority doesn't end there. The sports steering wheel, bucket seats, and a continuation of the gold stripes across the dashboard add to its beauty. The Warlock came in several ravishing colors like black, dark green, orange, and red. The set of color options offered in both versions, two or all-wheel drive. It is impossible to say exactly how many of these Warlock trucks were made, but in later years, Warlock 2 was made under a new name, which was introduced in 1979. Number 9. The 1978 Little Red Express When you are looking for a truck with both beauty and brain, look no further. The 1978 Little Red Express, a cherished classic among Dodge truck enthusiasts and collectors. This marks its popularity with finesse performance with the V8 engine, bold appearance and whatnot. This iconic piece holds a special place in the history of automotive. The Little Red Express arrived in 1978 and showed off hot rod style in truck form. This truck was powerful and fun in its D150 half-ton pickup build with a massive 360 cubic inch V8 engine. Yeah, that's heavy duty. And of course, the Little Red Express was only offered in bright red, hence the name. This was produced only in limited numbers during the late 70s, making it one of a kind. About 2,000 of these were sold in 1978 and another 5,000 in 1979. Number 8. The 1946 Power Wagon The immense impact this car made justifies its name, the 1946 Power Wagon. Indeed, the Power Wagon's appearance left a lasting impression throughout generations, debuting in 1945. It is not just the most iconic Dodge truck, it's arguably the most consequential pickup ever made. One of its exceptional features was its durability and resilience. To add to the features, top speed has offered a compelling argument that the Power Wagon was pivotal in building America because it was simply the most capable pickup of the time. It was just as comfortable and useful on the farm as it was on a construction site or even the battlefield. Also, it was decidedly awesome looking with those big, crazy flat fenders. No wonder why this was adored by many. Number 7. The Ram 1500 TRX This is one of the finest examples of top performance and capability. This was an all-rounder that worked well on roads and was equally good for off-road drives. Sounds like a deal, doesn't it? This truck of utmost luxury was designed where one can lavishly find and comfort themselves with everything one would ever need. From the very beginning with the 3035, Dodge has always strived to put more horsepower in their pickups than the competition. Their true legacy in the truck business has been producing the fastest, highest performing pickups on or off the road. That company goal came to a high mark in 2021 with the Ram 1500 TRX, which is the worst thing with four wheels and a truck bed ever built. The Tyrannosaurus Rex truck can gobble up 0 to 60 in 4.5 seconds and devour a quarter mile in 12.9 seconds, making it the apex predator of pickups. Number 6. The Ram SRT10 an iconic masterpiece known for its unique styling, V10 power engine, and performance. The perfect blend of such unparalleled traits marks its position in the history of Dodge trucks. As a company, Dodge is known for doing things for the simple reason that they can, and in 2004 they shoehorned a Viper V10 engine into a pickup because why not? The Dodge Ram SRT10 came with an 8.3 liter V10 engine that was first used in the third generation Dodge Viper. 
This Dodge Ram V10 provided an incredible 500 horsepower and 525 pound-feet of torque thanks to a supercharger. The Ram SRT10 could hit 0 to 60 in 4.9 seconds and blaze a quarter mile in 13.6 seconds, which is the kind of speed the classic Dodge muscle cars were famous for. Sounds fascinating, doesn't it? Let's turn that subscribe button gray already and spread the trucking legacy. Number 5. The D100 The Dude The Dude was a limited production which made the collectors still look back to that day. The Dude was a sports trim package Dodge offered on its D100 pickups in 1970 and 1971. It wasn't a performance package so much as it was a cool style trim. The Dudes featured big C stripes on the sides with an embedded Dude and cowboy hat decal. It's actually one of those things that would take years to appreciate because they only ended up selling 1,500 of these in two model years. Maybe if the big Lebowski had been out, there would have been more demand for the Dude. While it wasn't necessarily a performance truck, it sure as heck could have been. The Dude had access to all of Dodge's biggest V8s, so theoretically, someone could have ordered one with a 446 pack or a 426 Hemi. Let us all sign a petition to get the Dude back, shall we? Number 4. The D100 Custom Sports Special When buyers look over the top, then this is the truck. Style, comfort, opulence, performance, all in one. Dodge introduced the D-Series in 1961, following the success of the C-Series. This truck line remained in production until 1993. One of the first big advances of the D-Series came in 1963, when Dodge introduced a four-door crew cab version, which was the first pickup from any of the big three to feature two rows of seating. This was also the first swept line to offer several choices in engines, ranging from the slant sixes to even a few specially prepared show trucks. Standard power for this pioneering muscle truck was from a 365 horsepower and a big honking 426 Hemi under the hood. This package wasn't cheap, adding 1200 bucks to the base price, but it made for one hell of a fast truck. Number 3. The 1978 Dodge Macho Power Wagon Some are great for off-roading, but mostly not elegant. But this is a beauty and beast altogether. 1977 was a wild time. Bell bottoms were big, disco was on the radio, and Happy Days was the number one show on TV. Looking back at that era, the Dodge Macho Power Wagon also brought its own wow factor. The Macho Power Wagon was a special edition of the W150 4x4 pickup truck. Every Macho edition came with a factory roll bar and special tires. This off-road ready rubber was a set of 1015 LT-B tires wrapped around painted spoke or chrome disc wheels, depending on the year. Most Power Wagons featured a special paint such as a bright red or orange but the Macho Power Wagon was all about black interiors, most with bucket seats. I suppose now you imagine the Gars. Number 2. The C100 Swept Side Pickup trucks have their own legacy, but what people desired a lot was a luxurious pickup. That's exactly what's next. The C100 Swept Side. From the late 50s and 60s, it was a rare find and crafted with absolute finesse, which still makes Swept Side stand out among the others. The Dodge C-Series pickups, introduced in 1954, got the first major redesign since World War II and are some of the coolest trucks the company ever made. It was also Dodge's first attempt at a performance luxury pickup truck. Dodge still offered 4x4s that were branded Power Giant, but the classy ride from this generation was the smooth-looking swept side. Taking styling cues from the Dodge Custom Royale, it was as much a slick street cruiser as it was a pickup. Hemming says it just may be the prettiest pickup truck ever built. It definitely sounds like it, and it's one of the rarest, with only about 1,200 being built in a three-year production run, most of them in 1958, and they are almost impossible to find today. At number one, the 1939 T-Series. The final yet most fascinating antique of all is the 1939 T-Series. From 1939 to 1947, Dodge trucks were known as T-Series, V-Series, and W-Series, which is the most insane line of pickups ever manufactured. With streamlined Art Deco-style front sheet metal and introducing the concept of job-rated truck configurations, they also come with some nice flathead six-cylinder engines that were more powerful than the competition's offerings. With six payload classes, 20 different wheelbase lengths, plus a dozen of body styles and engine options, there were a staggering 1,842 possible configurations a customer could order. Again, pure insanity. 
Their historical value combined with sheer magnetism makes this an ultimate collector's edition. One video will never be enough, will it? So, smash the like button and hit subscribe to become part of the club. Remember to ring the bell so you won't miss out on any of our videos.